Hello, it's me, Kent Peters again, back at you with another video. And there's one thing I always said I would do when I was a kid. Yeah, it gets cold in part four where I live, so yes, I'm drinking tea. And that one thing I said I will do is save my money until I had a million dollars. I thought that was considered rich. And I'm pretty sure many people did consider a million dollars rich and still do. I mean, a million dollars is a lot of money. But at the same time, I mean, it's really not that much. I mean, can you retire off a million dollars? I mean, it's possible. Obviously, if you had a million dollars and you set the budget up to where you only spent like $50,000 a year, I mean, that could last for like two decades, two whole decades. Obviously, if you were like 70 and you suddenly got a million dollars somehow, that could work out for you. But if you're like in your 20s, also, as soon as that million dollars run out, after 20 years, you're going to be in your 40s then. Right back to where you started. Now, what you spent? How much would that money last if you spent 40000 a year? It could work. Even more, let's find out. So a million divided by 40. How long would that last? <laughs> okay, let's see how we, how long it will last. He spent 4,000 times. Let's try 30. So, it could last you five more years if he was using a $40,000 a month. No, $40,000 a year budget. It could push you up to like 25 years. So, 25 years is quite a bit. I mean, that's enough time to pretty much raise a kid. And that's if you was living off $40,000 a year for 25 years. With that one million dollars in your account. Also, you could push it further if you invest it, but I'm just assuming you just set your money up in the bank. Also, there will be interest, but for the sake of this video, I'm just going to ignore the interest. Now, what if you like really stretch your money and you decide to like try thirty thousand a year? So 30,000. Yeah, I'm just messing around with this. See how long I can pull, like a last. So 33 years, you would spend $9,000. Nine so you would have about and grand left over for now a million after 33 years. So living off 30,000, it could work. But what if you're like a bigger spender? I mean, obviously a million dollars is going to be enough to retire off of. It's not going to be that much really. Now the question is, if I suddenly obtain a million dollars where I got the million dollars by investing or if I somehow won the million dollars we're gonna say I suddenly got a million dollars in my account my child I finally realized my childhood dream I save my money to a million dollars I know we all wonder this question would I retire and the short answer is no because the million dollars this is not much for me to retire so I would still work if I had $1 million. I know some of y'all are shaking your heads, but 
like I said, it's really not that much money. So I would still be working. Obviously, I would have that money in the bank in investments. And of course, you know me investing in the stock market. I'll be making money from dividends. Plus, I'll be working. So when I'm doing that, when I'm having a million dollars and I'm working, I'm pretty sure I'll be living pretty good. I can stretch that money even further. I turn that money, that million dollar money. I could probably stress into two million, maybe, over time. So when I really do retire, I would have some money. I would have more than a million dollars. And hopefully at that point, I can live off it. I don't plan on living too long. <laughs> Realistically, I, I don't expect to live no more than five decades. But how much would I make? How much would I retire? Would I need to retire? So if I was on the, if there was like a limit to a minimum to what I would retire off of, I would add another zero to that a million dollars. So 10 million. I say that's a good amount to retire off of. I probably would quit my job. If I suddenly obtain $10 million. Because remember, $50,000 a million, he spent $50,000 a year for 20 years. That would be a million dollars. But guess what? Guess how much $10,000, $10 million could last if he spent $50,000 a year? I'm just going to guess. So where's that calculator? Clear everything. Clear history. Clear this. So if you spent $50,000 every year, how long would it take until you spend that whole $10 million? Guess what? It's going to take you 200 years. So in that case, the money could outlast you. And it could last to the next generation. Even if you decide to like, you know what, I'm going to spend $100,000 every year. How long would that last until you hit that $10 million? So he's So you spent a hundred thousand dollars every year. It's gonna take you one hundred years before you spend your whole ten million. So yes, that would be a good amount for me to retire off of. I don't know about you guys, but I can live off a of hundred thousand dollars a year. I don't even spend that much a year or two years. <laughs> Obviously, when I first get to ten million, of course, I probably would. Put some amount on the house. But then after a while, I don't think I'm going to spend $100,000 every single year. And y'all probably in the same situation. I mean, $100,000 a year. I mean, that's enough to live, to live pretty good in my book. So I would say $10 million is pretty much what I would consider rich. But a million dollars, I wouldn't quite consider it rich. But it's, it's a good amount of money, just not enough to retire off of. So that's what I'm going to say about that. So it's a million dollars to consider rich. I say it depends where you live. Obviously, you live like in a country that's not as expensive as America. A million dollars is probably going to stretch further. But in America, I'll say a million dollars is not rich. I'm sorry, guys, but I'm going to say it. A million dollars isn't rich. So, 
So whenever I do save a million dollars, like I said, I'm still going to be working. I'm still going to save even more money. Because the gold is to have that money outlast you. Especially when you're older, you're probably going to need even more money. Spend money on medical bills. You know how it is when you're old. But at the same time, you probably want because you don't have as many years ahead of you. Because obviously, if you're like 70, you're not going to think about what you're going to be doing 30 and 40 years from now. You're not going to have 40 years planned out probably. But if you're like 20 and 30, there's a good chance you're going to live another 40 years. So you're gonna have to have how much you're gonna have to have enough money to cover your lifetime. And enough for a next generation. So you like this video, give me a thumb up, subscribe to my channel. And by the way, I am doing another drawing on February 26th. I'm gonna give away a hundred dollars to one subscriber. And I had People who actually joined in the drawing yesterday. For some reason, they're not the comments they leave. It just doesn't show up in my video for some reason. I'm not sure why. But I am getting it does show up on a notification, so don't worry, I am getting your messages on the notification. I just thought that was weird. It doesn't show up on my video, but in a notification it does. So I will be doing that. A hundred dollars. And PayPal money, and you have to be a subscriber. So those are our two qualifications. In case you don't know what PayPal is, I'm pretty sure if you don't know what PayPal is by now, you've been living under a rock. But it's basically a way to like pay money online. Also, you mostly use it for places like eBay. That's one. But if you do have a PayPal account, whatever email address you use for your PayPal, that's what you want. You're going to want to give me. Because if you went, if you, I pull your name out, whatever email address you gave me, that's where I'm going to send that PayPal money to. So I hope you enjoyed this video. And I did speak the truth. If you, if you agree with me that a million dollars is not rich, just leave comments down here. If you do think a million dollars is rich, feel free to disagree. Feel free to leave comments. I'm pretty sure some of y'all probably do think a million dollars is rich. But I don't anymore. But with that being said, have a good day. And if you want to see more of my content, just subscribe and hit on that bell. That way you'll get an off whenever I do a video. But that being said, have a good weekend. Bye for now.